much do you know about spatial computing? Mm. <laughs> it's a term most of us aren't very familiar with, but that could soon change. This morning, Apple is launching the Apple Vision Pro here in Canada. And here's our pal tech expert, Mike Yanni, who joins us in studio for a closer look at this new tech as it makes its debut today. Mike, good morning to you. Good to see you. Good morning. All right, let's talk about this because I think a lot of people are wondering, what is this exactly? It's kind of hard to wrap your head around it unless you actually wrap this around your head and right. experience it. I've got to say, I've been doing this for a long time, and this is probably one of the most innovative, strange, and unique products that Apple has really ever released. It's, mm -hmm. it's quite a unique experience. I think the best way to put it is that it's like using an iPad and a MacBook, but you're immersed in it. Your eyes are the cursor, so wherever you look, that's your cursor. To click on the mouse, all you do is just make a little pinch motion with your hand, and it's easy as that. Mm -hmm. It's really unique. Now, what's cool about this is that I normally get to try these things out before the public, and I have no one's talked to about it. <laughs> but you guys got a chance to go hands-on with it as well before the public launch. Mm -hmm. I think we have some people, oh. some video to yeah, show. Guys. Of us experiencing Oh, that's me for, doing for a ten. pulse check because I was being interactive with dinosaurs and <laughs> I, we got really close and I got kind of scared. <laughs> it really is truly an immersive experience. Yes, same thing here. Me and the dinos and I, I'm petting oh, one. Oh, wow. There. Look at you. There's a bit of a snout brave. rub there. But I mean, really, this is such an immersive world when you go into this and it, it's 3D. You can look all around. I mean, it's quite revolutionary. It is something you really have to try it for yourself to, as you said, wrap your head around what you can do with it. Mm -hmm. All right, so let's talk more about the fun that you can have because we, when we did this afterward, we talked, mm -hmm. I was like, that was, so, that was wild. Right? It was so it wild. Was Mind blowing. And your yeah. reaction on camera is when you were interacting with the dinosaurs. So there's a dinosaur experience where, you know, the dinosaurs are walking and there's a warning that comes up on the screen. And this took me a a little bit of back, and it's like, warning, the creatures you are about to encounter can hear and see you. It's like, what do you mean? Yeah. That's right. uh, at one point, I said to the one dinosaur, hey, there's your buddy over there, and he looked, and then he right. ran off to him. And then they walk up to you, they approach you, and they're sniffing you, and you're like, I, I don't even know what to do. And at one point, I reached out, and it snapped at me, so I kind of went back. But there was another Still got all your fingers? Yeah, okay. I still got <laughs> it. But there's another point where a butterfly flew in the screen, and of course, you got to remember, you can see your surroundings. Mm -hmm. And I stuck out my finger, and the butterfly came and landed on it. Yeah. And then I was able to actually bring it up to my eyes. I could see the fine detail, the powder on the wings, and then, of course, the dinosaur came and scared it away yeah but there's other things too there's games so imagine playing sim city and you can actually have your living breathing sitting uh, city right on the tabletop here you can walk around it you can interact with it there are so many fun things you can mm -hmm. do with this. yeah okay yeah lots of fun the immersive sports by the way too I have to quickly uh, mention I mean that is a game changer part of the pun if you will with sports but uh, not only can you use this for fun but also it's got work applications productivity so you have all your apps like you have Safari you have keynote and things like that I actually got another demonstration that you guys didn't get to take part in Oh. Cool. so you can take the Apple Vision Pro and you can scan yourself and create uh, a spatial persona and I actually have a photo of it I want to bring up to show okay. you because I would say that's pretty lifelike. Mm -hmm. That's what wow, I look like, right? Yeah. But when you, have, when you have your Apple Vision Pro on, that's completely three-dimensional. So if you guys had one and I had one and we want to do a FaceTime, we can literally see each other, even if we're in different rooms across the country, you can walk around each other, you can give each other high fives virtually. But here's where it gets really cool. You can actually have Keynote up and you can each walk up to the board, to the presentation, mm. make changes. You can practice a presentation in front of a whole theater because you can change your environment. It's really like having somebody in the room. You can actually sit and watch a movie with somebody else who has Apple Vision Pro. And the audio when you're talking comes from the exact pinpoint where you are in your visor. Right, so it really does recreate, I mean, no matter where you are in the country, I mean, let's say you've got five people attending your meeting from five different locations, it feels like you're all in the same boardroom. It's so real that when the demo was done and I took off the Apple Vision Pro, mm -hmm. I said, like, where is everybody? I could have sworn you were right here with me, <laughs> and it took me a, a second to adjust to reality. <laughs> okay, so what do, we, what do we think? What do you think? You're the expert. Is this the next big thing? That's just it. A lot of people ask about that. What, what is it? You know, how big is it going to be? But here's the thing. It's cool. There's so many practical uses. There's fun uses for it. But you've got to consider the price tag. It's between about 4000 5000 Canadian. 
so it's expensive, so not a lot of people are going to have it. Could this take off? It could. There, there are VR headsets out there. There's augmented reality already out there. But I will say this, I think Apple kind of takes that step up. Mm. And it is, I've tried them all, this is a very unique experience. But I think it's going to take the price to come down a little bit and for people to learn about it and try it. And actually, you can actually go to an Apple store and try it yourself. You don't have to buy it. You can actually go online and book and just try it like we did because mm -hmm. it's a pretty cool experience. Yeah, honestly, you have to experience this for yourself. It's mm -hmm. so great. I don't know about you, Kara, but after we uh, tried it the other day on the ride home, drive home, I was looking for dinosaurs. <laughs> <laughs> did you find any? No. <laughs> Two. Or were they looking for you? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> All right, Mike, uh, this is available starting today, right? Starting today in Canada. All right, great to see you. Thank you.